Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got during our half trading day of June 10, 2020. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Corporate Bond ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a weak opportunity to buy industrial sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $74.38. For call option, a possible call price is at $2.16. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell technology sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $102.49. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.9. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Valero Energy. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 10.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $71.8. For call option, a possible call price is at $3.07. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Baker Hughes Company is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.2%. You may expect now a buy return of 4.7%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $18.14, but we expect a possible buy price of $17.7. .7. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Baker Hughes Company, if it is below 0.45% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, Baker Hughes Company has a striking price at $17. For this option, the actual call price is at $1.3, but we expect a possible call price at $1.25. AOG Resources is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 3.9%. You may expect now a buy return of 5.7%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $57.92, but we expect a possible buy price of $56.06. In addition, we suggest to stop buying AOG resources, if it is below 1.55% of your stock price trade. On the call option table. AOG Resources has a striking price at $56. For this option, the actual call price is at $2.89, but we expect a possible call price at $2.45. 
financial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock stable of financial sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Berkshire Hathaway. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 8.4%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $194.42. For call option, a possible call price is at $5.26. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. American Express is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 0.7%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $108.67. But we expect a possible buy price of $107.02. In addition, we suggest to stop buying American Express. If it is below 4.25% of your stock price trade, on the call option table, American Express has a striking price at $107. For this option, the actual call price is at $4.8, but we expect a possible call price at $3.27. American International G is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.4%. You may expect now a buy return of 3.4%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $36.06. In addition, we suggest to stop buying American International G. If it is below 1.10% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, American International G has a striking price at $36. For this option, the actual call price is at $1.72, but we expect a possible call price at $1.27. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of real estate sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Prologis. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.4%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $96.34. For call option, a possible call price is at $3.33. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Simon Property Group. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 8.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $72.33. For put option, a possible put price is at $4.48. Crown Castle is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 1.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $173.48. But we expect a possible sell price of $181.16. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Crown Castle. If it is over 0.40% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, Crown Castle has a striking price at $185. For this option. The actual put price is at $8.45, but we expect a possible put price at $7.05. Prologis is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.4%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $96.34, but we expect a possible buy price of $93.94. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Prologis, if it is below 0.25% of your stock price trade. 
On the call option table, Prologis has a striking price at $93. For this option, the actual call price is not available. But we expect a possible call price at $3.33. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Medtronic PLC. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $100.13. For call option, a possible call price is at $3.15. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Abbey Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.6%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $95.17. For put option, a possible put price is at $2.43. Abbey Incorporated was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Abbey Incorporated is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.2%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.6%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $95.35. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $100.5. On the put option table, Abbey Incorporated has a striking price at $100. For this option, the actual put price is not available. But we expect a possible put price at $2.43. Medtronic PLC is a mild buy suggestion. It is on a trade normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 5.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $100.13. But we expect a possible buy price of $97.42. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Medtronic PLC. If it is below 0.60% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, Medtronic PLC has a striking price at $97. For this option, the actual call price is at $6.2. But we expect a possible call price at $3.15. Merck Incorporated was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Merck Incorporated is a bull normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 0.8%. You may expect now a buy return of 3.8%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $84.77. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $80.9. On the call option table, Merck Incorporated has a striking Pfizer Incorporated was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Pfizer Incorporated is a bare normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.6%. You may expect now a sell return of 3.8%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $34.71. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $37.28. On the put option table, Pfizer Incorporated has a striking price at $37. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.98. 
but we expect a possible put price at $0.73. United Health Group is a mild buy suggestion. It is on a trade low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 2.4%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $306.16. But we expect a possible buy price of $301.99. In addition, we suggest to stop buying United Health Group if it is below 1.90% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, United Health Group has a striking price at $300. For this option, the actual call price is at $11.6. But we expect a possible call price at $6.79. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Lockheed Martin is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 0.7%. You may expect now a buy return of 5.2%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $408.67. But we expect a possible buy price of $399.28. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Lockheed Martin. If it is below 1.00% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, Lockheed Martin has a striking price at $395. For this option, the actual call price is at $10.3. But we expect a possible call price at $7.36. Waste management is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 2.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $111.22, but we expect a possible buy price of $109.08. In addition, we suggest to stop buying waste management, if it is below 2.35% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, waste management has a striking price at $109. For this option, the actual call price is not available. But we expect a possible call price at $3.13. Material sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of material sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy DuPont and Amours. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.5%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $55.25. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.72. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Ecolab Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 1.9%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $207.43. For put option, a possible put price is at $5.32. DuPont and Amours is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.2%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $55.25, but we expect a possible buy price of $54.42. In addition, we suggest to stop buying DuPont and Amours, if it is below 1.00% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, DuPont and Amours has a striking price at $54. 
For this option, the actual call price is at $2.09. But we expect a possible call price at $1.72. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of discretionary sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy General Motors. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 4.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $29.09. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.03. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Amazon Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $2,567.13. For put option, a possible put price is at $55.57. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of Staples sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Mondelez International. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.9%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $53.15. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.12. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Colgate Palmolive is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 0.9%. You may expect now a sell return of 0.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $73.49, but we expect a possible sell price of $74.92. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Colgate Palmolive. If it is over 3.85% of your stock price trade, on the put option table, Colgate Palmolive has a striking price at $75. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.67, but we expect a possible put price at $1.23. CVS Health Corporation is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.0%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.6%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $68.78, but we expect a possible buy price of $67.55. In addition, we suggest to stop buying CVS Health Corporation, if it is below 0.25% of your stock price trade, on the call option table. CVS Health Corporation has a striking price at $67. For this option, the actual call price is at $2.29, but we expect a possible call price at $1.76. Estee Lauder is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 0.6%. You may expect now a buy return of 0.9%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $202.78, but we expect a possible buy price of $197.01. In addition, we suggest to stop buying SD Lauder. If it is below 4.60% of your stock price trade, on the call option table, SD Lauder has a striking price at $195. For this option, the actual call price is at $8.55, but we expect a possible call price at $6.03. Procter & Gamble was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Procter & Gamble is a bull normal class. In the past, 
it has given an average buy return of 0.4%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $120.92. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $118.26. On the call option table, Procter & Gamble has a striking price at $117. For this option, the actual call price is at $3.48, but we expect a possible call price at $2.37. Walmart Corporation is a mild B suggestion. It is on a trade high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 0.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 0.6%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $122.46, but we expect a possible buy price of $119.42. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Walmart Corporation if it is below 3.90% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, Walmart Corporation has a striking price at $119. For this option, the actual call price is at $3.35, but we expect a possible call price at $2.14. Technology Sector ETF was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Technology Sector ETF is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.4%. You may expect now a sell return of 4.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $99.41. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $106.68. On the put option table, Technology Sector ETF has a striking price at $105. For this option, the actual put price is at $2.84, but we expect a possible put price at $1.9. Let's look at the stocks table of Technology Sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Western Digital. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 13.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $46.98. For call option, a possible call price is at $2.45. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell NVIDIA Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 10.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $376.65. For put option, a possible put price is at $12.63. Oracle Corporation is a weak buy suggestion. It is on a bull low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 0.3%. You may expect now a buy return of 5.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $54.35, but we expect a possible buy price of $52.54. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Oracle Corporation, if it is below 1.30% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, Oracle Corporation has a striking price at $52. For this option, the actual call price is at $2.38 but we expect a possible call price at $1.92. Texas Instruments was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Texas Instruments is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 2.0%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $130.98, but we expect a possible buy price of $127.83. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $135.16. On the put option table, Texas Instruments has a striking price at $140. For this option, the actual put price is at $8.18 but we expect a possible put price at 
Western digital is a mild buy suggestion. It is on a trade low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 13.2%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $46.98. But we expect a possible buy price of $45.73. In addition, we suggest to stop buying Western Digital. If it is below 3.40% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, Western Digital has a striking price at $45. For this option, the actual call price is at $3.9, but we expect a possible call price at $2.45. Communication Sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of communication sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Utility sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utility sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Southern Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $59.42. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.54. Dominion Energy was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Dominion Energy is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $84.34. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $87.3. On the put option table, Dominion Energy has a striking price at $88. For this option, the actual put price is not available but we expect a possible put price at $1.83. Southern Company was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Southern Company is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.2%. You may expect now a sell return of 4.3%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $56.97. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $60.92. On the put option table, Southern Company has a striking price at $61. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.56, but we expect a possible put price at $1.54. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good update of our half trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.